Here's what you missed on Fathead and Candy in the morning. Weekdays, 6 to 10 a.m. on My Country 96.1. My Country 96.1 Fathead Candy Roth. Candy is uh, not pleased with me at the moment. You know, I what? dreamt that they lost my dog. Oh, Someone Tilly. lost my dog and they couldn't find her, and I was absolutely flipping out. That would be Did crazy. Did you ever dream of something like that? Um, I've had different wacky dreams, but, you know, not that they lost my dog, I don't think. Yeah, it was really disturbing. I did, uh, before we get into you, because we got to get into you. You know, we're always getting into me. And then when Uh, we try to get into you, you're like, I I, I can't talk about this. I did did rank my dogs the other day. I I just wanted, I don't know why, I I said, you know, uh, I want to put a list together. And I was curious, in our house, the kids, Dana, how they would rank our five dogs and you know, uh, did we talk about this already? I feel like we talked no. about this. We didn't talk no. about this. Okay. So how we would rank our five dogs, um, you know, that we've had all together, Electra, Tony, uh, Millie, Lucy, and Roxy. And I said, what if someone offered you a million dollars to rank them all? You forget hurting their feelings. You got to rank them. And, uh, of course, Tony's my number one, Candy. You know of that. Of course. Uh, Millie is my number two. Look at that. Does Lucy know how you feel? Well, you so Roxy is my three. And I had just You just, gave her away. Just to make Lucy not feel bad, I tied her with Electra at number four. And then she jumped on my lap and uh and, and I felt bad, so I apologized to her all day. Wow, and Lucy just was like, <laughs> Get away from me now. I just had to apologize. Roxy, all you day. actually gave away you you gave the dog away. We didn't give Roxy away. Oh. You that is revisionist history. Uh huh. Where did the dog live? About two minutes away at my in law's house. And then when they moved to Delaware? De- no. She died Roxy before they moved passed. to Delaware. That's correct. Uh-huh. Don't tell me. Yeah. Oh, whatever. Yeah. She didn't you, live with you. She didn't live with us, but that was because we just moved into a brand new house. We had two little children at the time. We had Electra and Tony, and Roxy was a shedding machine. And we just didn't have the energy or the time or the wherewithal to bring her over here. And here's the other thing. Dana's parents fell in love with her. That was their, like, security blanket when we left, Candy. But we were over there all the I time. I don't even know that she should be on the list, quite frankly. Don't tell me Roxy doesn't belong on the list. Oh, Roxy... I don't think so. Anyway, I love now them all. We all have to have the same address to be on that list. <laughs> I love them all equally, except Tony. Tony's my number one. <laughs> and Lucy, where does Lucy fall in all of this? Well, the Lucy is tied for last with Electra. Tied but I, for last. I hate even saying that because Electra was like just a fantastic puppy. Anyway, these are the things I do when I'm not on the air. This is how my life, very my brain. Very aggravating. Very, very aggravating. I like to cause myself stress by ranking my dogs. you're causing me stress by telling <laughs> me the list. So you were out yesterday. I was. And... Was it for, for your allergies? Because you came in today sounding No, but awful. the allergies, anyone who's suffering knows that the last few days have been really bad, exceptionally high pollen. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I've had bad allergies, and then I had a stomach issue. It's a whole nother story. I don't feel like going into my issue, okay? I'm a woman with many ailments. Leave me alone. What did you eat over the weekend? I don't think it was, you know, it's really hard to tell. You know, I have diverticulitis. Right. Okay. So it's hard to tell sometimes, and all of a sudden it'll hit. So um, I got some antibiotics, and now I feel much better. Okay, I thought Do maybe I have Bri- to go into it with you. I thought maybe Brian made some bad chicken or something, no, or no, okay, no, no. He's all right, wonderful. We've been getting along beautifully. All right, good. I'm glad uh, it wasn't him that poisoned Until you. Until my girlfriend you. came over, maybe this is what made me sick. And they had an argument over politics, but that's a whole nother story. Well, hold on. You, who came over? Barry? Ellen. 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 You got two girlfriends, Barry and Ellen. I have more than two, but okay. But those are you two. Those are your well, your people. They're, they're, I've known them since childhood. All right. So Ellen comes over and her and Brian get into it about politics? Yes. Ruined like the whole day. so much so where she had to get up and leave? Um, it wasn't a nasty argument, so to speak, but yeah, it, it, we were on the deck, a little bit of rain started to fall. I was like, oh, it's raining. <laughs> and, um, yeah, <clears throat> excuse me. Are you all right over there? Yes, Come on. I'm fine. Be quiet. 
Next Turn time a you have a scathing headache, which you have pretty oh, often, I do. I'm going to mention it on the air every break. Oh, please don't. Uh, I'm sorry. You had a, oh. you had a big political I fight. Had, oh, I have an ice pack <laughs> on my head. Oh. Nothing works Next better. Next time, you're going to get it. You got a headache. You take your pill, your Aleve, your whatever you take, and then you put ice pack on the front and I'm back happy, of your head. Um, I'm happy to say that's not one of my elements. I rarely have a headache. All right. We're going to give Candy a chance to blow her nose. We're going to come back at 730. Uh, we've got a special song, as always, your next entertainment, less than an hour away, right around 8, 12 or so. Um, I talked briefly yesterday about a couple of shows I watched on Netflix, but I saved the big descriptions for you oh. today, Candy. Oh, thank I, you. I, I, I have a I few for you. can't live without your Netflix uh, ratings. Let's go. Hey, for, for a, a woman who never <laughs> never leaves her house, you I need my... I do, leave my house. I'll be quiet. All right. You need my Netflix ratings. I've had enough of you already. All right. My country, 96.1. Fathead and Candy in the morning, weekdays, 6 to 10 a.m. on My Country, 96.1.